let's talk a little music, right? That there was a clip from our friends John O'Leary, Sean Martin. It is on an upcoming album, the two of them working together, not just working on together on albums these days, also working together on an upcoming show. Good morning, John. Sean, how are Good you? Good morning. Good morning. So let's dive right in. John, we've gotten to know you before. Last time I think we yes. saw you, you were in studio with us with Love yes. Lisa, right? That's right. And uh, yes. fast forward, throw a pandemic, and now we're talking virtually. Mm -hmm. Sean, we haven't got to catch up with you yet, but as a member of Snarky Puppy, you were just here for the Clearwater Jazz Holiday, right? That's, that's right. That's right. Sure was. So coming back to the area and a performance that is the first of its kind, according to you, John and Sean, you guys have worked <laughs> together for a while now. Talk about why you decided to do this show. Why are we doing a, a two piano live show at the Palladium on Sunday? John, we'll go ahead and start with you. Yeah, well, this is uh, first uh, really exciting to share this collaboration with Sean. Uh, Sean is an incredible, incredible pianist and musician uh, and person. Just so much fun to hang out with him and, and be around him. And uh, when, when we worked on this album together uh, during the pandemic, um, I knew that when I did a release show, this is like a soft pre-release show because the actual release of the album is not till January. Uh, but I knew I wanted to find a way to play with Sean. Uh, when we were in the studio, we just had so much chemistry together, like hanging and playing and our styles just really meshed really well. I was just in heaven and it's an absolute honor to work with him. Uh, and I was going to say, it seems like you've got that good connection, just getting to talk with you before we get started, despite Sean's Dallas Cowboys hat. <laughs> I had to go there a little bit, John. Oh my I love it. I love it. <laughs> you are coming Let's to go. us from Dallas. Talk about your perspective on a show like this. I mean, is it kind of like a dueling piano kind of thing, or are you guys working together? Like, how do you put something like this together, Sean? Right. So um, it's not really like a dueling piano kind of thing. It's, it's definitely uh, making it a point to showcase, of course, uh, our talents, but as well as the, the produced product that we came together uh, to do. John is a phenomenal pianist, as you all know, um, you, know it's, you know, from that area. And so it was important for me to be able to, from the record standpoint, to be able to make sure that he emotes um, every emotion that he has for the Sundering, as well as playing this show. You know, it's like we got to get out and play it. You know, I mean, he's, he's such a such a phenomenal pianist, and so I'm very very honored to be able to uh, share the stage with him. Oh, I love that. Yeah. And again, same to you. Nine Grammys to your name, Sean, and being able yes. to bring that talent. I, you know, I make the joke about your uh, your Cowboys <laughs> hat, but really, you do wear multiple hats. We'll say going from producing an album and then getting to play in it. I think you're on three of the tracks I was reading on this album coming out in right. January. Mm -hmm. You know, talk about being able to, as a musician, being able to be involved in so many different aspects. That at the end of the day, the goal is still to create good music, which the both of you do. Right, right, right. Well, I, I think the, the biggest thing is you get a very limited amount of sleep off the top, <laughs> <laughs> you know. Um, but 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 players like John make it easy, right? You know, when you have people who they pay attention to their craft, they hone their craft, you know, they live and love their craft. It's really kind of easy, so it makes my job really easy. You know, but I do, I wear a lot of hats though. I do wear a lot of hats. <laughs> and, and John, I mean, the way, you know, he's given you praises and you've already mm -hmm. given, you know, him praises for his work. What are you looking forward to most for Sunday? What do we want people out there who are watching to go ahead and say, this is the show that I want to come out and see come this coming weekend? I'll tell you what I'm looking forward to is spending time with this guy right here. <laughs> every time, every time that we are together, it's like I can't help but to feel incredibly happy and honored. And it's just like he's like he's one of my heroes. He's one of my heroes. <laughs> I look up to this guy and he's like my older brother. That's like incredible and then i get to like hang out with him and play and he's gonna be playing i'll be there too i'll clap <laughs> and uh, man it's gonna, be, it's, gonna, it's gonna be a party are you kidding me it's just um, that's what i'm looking forward to the vibe 
the it's i mean i'm smiling i'm laughing just talking with the both of you being able to talk with you and see you play it is going to be a fun night for sure let's make a deal though john i already touched on the base you were in studio with us before the pandemic sean next time too you're in town and we do get back we'd love to see you in person and get a performance love, what do you say? love to be there Ab absolutely deal well again it's going to be a lot of fun this sunday sean martin john o'leary tickets at myplanium.org guys thanks for your time